All right, it is officially time to go. We have got all our, oh, you gotta be kidding me. <laughs> There's always something left. Just shove it. Just shove it in there. Wait, where is the, it's on the bottom, of course. I literally just closed this bag. Just barely. <sighs> We've been up since like 7 a.m. I've been editing and packing and getting everything cleaned and dried. Make sure there's no more swimsuits outside drying, right? Mine wasn't. Mine but was just. You shoved it in there? Okay, are you ready to go home or are you sad to leave? Ready to go home. You ready to go home? <laughs> I like it, but. It's hard to be out of your own comfort zone. Jacob accidentally told his, put AM instead of PM, so his mom thought he was supposed to be home by last night. <laughs> Not this morning. So, had a little bit of a worry from her this morning. But we're all ready to go. Eating the last of our food. We do have leftover food, um, condiments. I'm not going to take those home. And freezer food. We've got waffles, cheese, and those chicken. We got the wrong kind. So, say lovey, right? Okay, we're going to go. Everyone's ready to go home. Correct? Yes. Correct? Okay, I'm going to go get one last view. Oh, boo-hoo. Mom? This is going to be the last time we're going to come. It isn't going to be the last time we're going to come. Snarkiness. Not, Snarky. Privileged. <laughs> yeah, privileged much. I'll come without you, my friend. You I'll come without you. Snarky kids. I love Maui. It'll be a few years before we come back here. We're going to do a new island next time. I'm terrified of when I'm gonna be able to come back next. <laughs> I don't want it to be very long. Everyone in the comments below tell Jason he needs to come here for his 50th birthday this year. His birthday is in October. It's the perfect time to come again. Leave a comment below and pressure him to bring me back. Not the kids, just me for his 50, 50th birthday. I'll definitely choose to come here for my 50th. I mean, all of you have said Hawaii looks so good on me, so. He just wants me to look better. He needs to bring me back, right? I literally hate saying goodbye to this place. I'm, I miss it so much when I go home. I'll, I'll take your drink. I'll, if you can get suitcases, here I'll take it. Hand it to me. It's fine. You can okay. Okay. One thing I will say is our family is good at traveling. Everyone. I know. Okay. <laughs> person that you call up when you're down wanna be the first who knows all of your deepest secrets can i be the one who wakes you up before you miss your ride because i want to be close to you and i want to show you something new you gotta know every day i got your back here yeah, you can count on me for that so put your hand in mine, I will be there every day When you're sick of the climb, I will make sure it's okay I you didn't ask for it Alright, a trip home would not be complete without A trip to Walmart A trip to Walmart First time we've actually come to Walmart since we've gotten here This is the longest stretch we've ever gone on any trip Alright, we got our snacks It was crazy busy in there um, everyone, we got Pringles. Ashley got the coolest snacks, I think. Cause she doesn't eat the food on the plane, so we had to get her a little Sargento cheese platter thingy, little containers. Um, but for those of you who are wondering if you have a large vehicle like this one when you come to Hawaii, if it's better to prepay for your gas or fill it up on your own and bring it back full, correct? Is that the option? Um, we have sightseed, we didn't do the full road to Hana, um, but we've been driving all over the island and we have literally used the tank of gas. We have 53 miles left, our um, gas light just went on and it's perfect timing. We'll take it back to the airport and we don't have to do anything else with it. It's the cheapest, if you know you're going to use the full tank, it's the best way to go because we paid a cheaper price per gallon for gas than we would if we, we had had to fill up on our own and paid the fee to do that. So we are officially at the airport now. Over there, I know you always like some. Oh, I 
Okay, so this little one back here, where is he? He's oh out. no, you can't have you can't have this now. <laughs> well, you'll have seen him. He was he was playing in, behind my head, but we are officially at the airport. But he doesn't want to admit that I was right and we were gonna be fine. I told him he couldn't go ape on us if it went over. He won't he won't say it. Lines are horrible out here. We're not even inside to check in for security. We haven't even gone in there for security. We're stuck out here underneath a tent. Alright, sadly we are back home. Cold weather. I, I would say that was like, wasn't a bad flight. That so baby, baby cried more than half happening. the time. At least for three hours. Yeah. And I was like, I wish I, I usually keep lollipops in my bag. For no one, not even for my own kids. I would I mean the baby is not even one. I would have stuck a lollipop in there, stuck in, in their mouth. I'm like, parent, I don't even care what you say. This kid needs to pop their ears. And it'll help them. Oh my gosh, I don't know why. Why do they have a baby? I don't know. Why don't they? Anyway, so baby cried for a very long time. And then I dropped my AirPods. <laughs> and Jason was like, you are not losing another pair. So Chelsea had to crawl underneath my seat. Guys, hey, wait, wait, wait. Okay. I'll see you go. It's fine. Or you can t do you want to go with Abby? Dad, Abby? No? Okay. Do you want to come with me? Do you have one just in there? Ash Chelsea, why don't you, yeah, you go with Ash, Ashley, go with Dad. No. no. You'll be in the way. You no. just go with Dad. So, um, we're kind of doing a bathroom stop right here, but Jason's going to run out and go call the shuttle. Get the shuttle back to our hotel. Get the car, bring it back to us. Hopefully in that amount of time we'll have our luggage, so it'll be a little bit faster. Um, we are on a mad dash to get home to go to bed. <laughs> <laughs> we, our flight um, was an hour late. Is Jacob? Um, no, we'll, we'll take him home. home. Yeah, we'll take him home. It was an hour late, and we have a three-hour drive still. We're in the way here. Sorry. Um, plus, we're in a mad dash to so get food. We're all hungry, and everything closes in 45 minutes near the airport. And we've learned from last year that there's nothing else. Within a one hour distance that's still open. Alright, we <laughs> just started choking and everyone was making fun of me. We have officially <laughs> made it to Wendy's <laughs> before it closed. That was our mission. <laughs> Despite the fact that we're going to get home at 3 in the morning, that was our goal to make sure we hit Wendy's before 1 a.m. <laughs> and we have accomplished our goal. We've gotten a lot of food and then we're going to drive home. <laughs> Can't even... <clears throat> we weren't talk. laughing at you because you were choking. It's because I burped really loud and then you started laughing and then choking and laughing yeah. at the same time. And dad was asking me questions and I was like, does it look like I can answer you? Exactly. <clears throat> Did you see those little flurries? Yeah, there was like little flurries. It's a plant. Okay, we made it home safe. But we're going to bed. Can you even see me? It's 3 30 in the morning. I gotta move Jason's car. Oh my gosh, you guys were so tired. It's the next morning. I figured I'd do a little addition to our travel day home, give you a dose of the reality <laughs> that our life is. We got home at 3 30 yesterday, and I have never cared so less to unpack and organize or do anything. I, I didn't even care. I grabbed I wouldn't even have grabbed my bathroom bags, but Jason grabbed them out because his was underneath mine. Um, I would have just gone straight to my room and brushed my teeth with my brush 
the day I left at home and gone to bed, but he got my bathroom stuff out, so I actually washed my face, brushed my teeth, and went to bed. Um, we all took melatonin as we got into bed, and Jason and I tossed and turned, didn't sleep well at all. Um, I let everyone sleep in. Abby only missed her first period. Um, Chelsea had actually been... <sighs> Uh, missed just the first little bit of their school. Um, I'm going so slow right now, you guys. I'm in a school zone, and then I'm going to put the camera down. Uh, I just don't ever want to get a stupid ticket here in the school zone. But I just did a round of dropping everyone off at school, because I let them sleep in, and excused all their absences this morning. Kaylee decided to stay home, because she's like, I don't care. She has really easy classes right now. She timed it quite well for her senior year. So she's stayed home today to sleep and get caught up. And uh, I am gonna take you to Costco with me. We have a list already. Abby just made it for me. I'm doing a mad dash at a very slow pace probably <laughs> because I'm so tired through Costco. Um, because if I hurry, I can be home by 10.30 and I can take a nap. I was kind of stupid and agreed to do a scan at one o'clock today. I just know I'm gonna fall asleep through it and I think it's a stomach one and they need you to breathe. <laughs> they need to like have you hold your breath and as they get their imaging. And so it'll already hurt it off. If I do get a nap, but I can't imagine trying to do it if I don't get a nap. So I'm gonna, I might even just go straight to bed because if I lay down on the couch and even glimpse all the suitcases, they're all opened up. I'll show you when I get home. They're all opened up on my bedroom floor, or on my kitchen floor, <laughs> and living room floor. They're everywhere. They're just open. I have a load of laundry going because that was easy. It's a mess. But I'm just going to give you a dose of what it's like to actually get home from paradise. It's not so paradise. All right, we have all of our fruits and veggies, cucumbers, peppers. I got some potatoes, raspberries, blueberries, grapes, bananas, pineapple, because, you know, and then um, lettuce. We're going very fast. Okay, we added milk and eggs, and Abby wanted goldfish. We are out of goldfish, and I need to pick a chip. Pirate's Booty was the chip choice, and this is dinner tonight, because I am not gonna wanna cook. Everyone is gonna be so tired, so I'm just gonna do that. Okay, cheese section. We've got cream cheese, regular uh, cheddar cheese, cottage cheese, and yogurt. We've gotta clear up our get. <laughs> And I think that's it. Not bad, not even 10.30. One last thing, peanut butter, because it's on rebate. Just through next, the end of this week. So, last thing. I mean, I'm so good. We are leaving. Okay, back at home. Gonna prove to you guys, we literally dumped and ran to bed. <laughs> it's absolutely ridiculous. To be fair, that's all shoes. Literally, you can just get dumped there. But as you can see, there's already a lot of shoes there. That's Jason's bag. He dumped that out to get to his work stuff. I need to pull out my computer, upload a thumbnail. Sorry for the zip lining video, not having a thumbnail. I tried to get my computer to work last night on the plane, and it wouldn't. I couldn't. Obviously, I couldn't access the internet from the plane, but also couldn't get my little disk drive to turn on. So I'm gonna sign off with you guys and uh, take a nap. My computer's not turning on anyway, so, or I mean, it's turning on, but I'm gonna sign off with you guys and I'm gonna take a few days off as well. <laughs> I have a lot of videos to edit, life to catch up on, um, including, Hopefully, scheduling Abby's surgery. I expected them to call me last week, but they did not. So I had to call them. Not gonna happen today, which is why I need to 
kind of have some time to catch up on life. So, thank you. I'm sorry I don't have as much energy today to be as enthusiastic about Hawaii stuff as I have been for this whole week. Really, like, the whole month. Um, but, what am I trying to do here? I don't want to do that. I can't even think. I'm going to sign off with you guys. Take care. Thanks for enjoying our Hawaii videos. Um, I am going to try and get up a souvenir haul, but I need everyone to pull their stuff out. I didn't get time to do it from um, Hawaii, so we'll do it from home, um, but I will bring you little snippets of Hawaii in that video, so stay tuned for that, and we will see you next time. Easy, easy on our tiptoes.